Hi guys, I've been asked to do an interpretation video by Robin S.B. So I'm just going to tell you what I think about this Google Doodle. Broccoli, lemon, tomato, soap, egg, acid. If you take the first letters of each of those words, you can get the word bleats, which is the characteristic weak wavering cry of the sheep, goat or calf. So it could be referencing sheep to the slaughter. If we're talking about Google and the possible messaging that they may be, may be portraying with these um, doodles. Um, and then you've got the H plus symbol up there, which is hydrogen. It's not connected to any other lettering like CL or anything, but, you know, chloride. So it's just hydrogen by itself. The only thing I can think of in hydrogen terms is the hydrogen bomb, which North Korea said they was going to test in the Pacific Ocean. Um, and that could, if that happens and, you know, something bad on the curse because of that, maybe somewhere is hit directly or maybe something is affected like Kilauea earthquake tsunami you know the scenario by now um that could be where sh the uh sheep to the slaughter reference comes in um if you're supposed to uh convert this into the word bleats i really don't know but that's i didn't struggle to make it i just took the first letters of each of those items and put them together put them into a scrabble finder four words came up two words kind of made sense to me tables and bleats tables obviously i don't think there's anything i can connect it to but bleats being sheep sheep to the slaughter hydrogen bomb possible how possible i don't know but that's the possible interpretation there's probably others um and the last thing i wanted to point out is the the hair it just stood out to me because may 31st is a day i'm watching quite closely for what's going to happen in re reference to the iran nuclear deal can the european country save it and if not, Iran said they're going to start up their nuclear program, which enrichment can be done within two to three days. Um, they have their secret ICBM program. So if they combine those two together, they've got a launchable nuclear weapon. Um, the top security officials from the United States, John Bolton, and from Israel, can't remember his name, are meeting today for a joint comprehensive plan on Iran. Um, so it could be that if come the 31st of May, things fail, and Iran does start up its nuclear program, could be a pre preemptive strike on the Iranian nuclear facilities that they know of in the country. According to the IPEC GOAT video, there's retaliation after that. We really don't know until it happens, but those are the possible interpretations. So that's pretty much what I've got for you on this one. I didn't spend too much time on the Google Doodle um, just because I couldn't really see anything that was jumping out at me. But... Um, Apart from the word bleats, sheep to slaughter, hydrogen bomb, 31st, three hairs and one hair. That's my interpretation. You guys have a good morning, good afternoon, good evening, and God bless.